Turner Pictures Worldwide Distribution presents The Flintstones, starring in Holly Rockabye Baby from Hanna Barbera. Pebbles and Bam Bam are all grown up, and they've got big news for Fred, Barney, Wilma, and Betty in this pre-hysterical movie-length video. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. Bammer and I have been doing great since we moved to Holly Rock. Besides my job transfer at the ad agency and Bam Bam working hard on his screenplay, we've been really busy. <laughs> <gasps> Why don't you and the Rebels come out to Holly Rock for the big event? But babies aren't the only things on Fred's mind. This is Holly Rock, where dreams come true. His dream is to mingle with the stars, and before long, he's Fred Flintstone, agent to the stars. I'm gonna sell Bam Bam's screenplay if it's the last thing I do. Of course it nearly is when Fred gets mixed up with the mob. Holly Rockabye Baby, the Flintstones' newest movie. This one's a comedy, a tearjerker, a life-transforming experience. It pulls at the heartstrings and the hamstrings. It's a guarantee hit. Coming soon to home video at all your favorite video shops. That show is. Long ago, the world was an exciting and mysterious place, full of magic and wonder, where love prevailed and evil was banished where you were just as likely to run into princesses or pirates as you would a couple of bears in a lab, a gorilla in a crow's nest, and a guy and his dog just looking for a ride. Hanna-Barbera presents Arabian Nights, three classic tales featuring an oasis of stars. Here we go again. Our story begins with a prince searching for his lost princess. And when all seems lost and evil forces prevail, our hero comes to the rescue. That's you, Yogi. What's going on? Oh. And if you need any more explanation than that, uh... Then, it's off to the high seas in pursuit of... <laughs> Rock's egg, precious gems, golden toothbrush. <laughs> Finally, our dynamic duo eat their way to adventure. A nourishing tale of Sultan meets princess, but Sultan finds our princess needs a shave. It's them! Like Hyde! Join Hanna-Barbera in a twist on the classic Eastern tale, Arabian Nights. There's magic in the air with your favorite Hanna-Barbera characters. They're all alike. So reserve some time. How about toasted marshmallows? No! And maybe suggest a napkin for Hanna-Barbera's Arabian Nights. You're a full-fledged genie. Leon, look at their necks. Here we go again. Your necks are bigger than your heads. Ma, it's only because there are no muscles in our heads to exercise. The Barbarian Brothers. Yo, nice hair. Is that a supercut? They're big. Oh, indubitably, indubitably. Bold. You Junior, maybe you should lay off the growth hormone. Why? And fast with their fists. You have to excuse my brother. He needs electrocution lessons. But when they come between the mob and the feds. The boys really got a job on the hoods. I want to offer you a job. I'd like you to stay here and look after my nephews. It's the start of a whole new career. Yo, who the babysitters? The babysitters. What are they anyway? They're like some kind of cloning experiment that went horribly wrong. <laughs> They thought that no one could face them down. What? Man, they're just little kids. Mm, little monsters more like it. No! But this time, they've met their match. All we've got to do to win them over is show them that they can trust us. Yeah, how do we do that? Well, boys, say hello to your Uncle Frank. <laughs> it's time for your bath. You don't want to take a bath. <laughs> Let's go. The Barbarian Brothers. Yeah. 
here, everybody fasten your seatbelt. The Babysitters. Man, even their cars on steroids. What are we gonna do? I got an idea. Go faster! Dumb, a person lacking mental power. What's her last name? I'll look it up. Starts with an S. Swappy. No. Swamp. Swappy. Nah. Uh, maybe it's on the briefcase. Look on the. Oh yeah! It's right here. Samsonite. I was way off. Idiot. An adult mentally inferior to a child of three. Skis, huh? That's right. The years? Uh huh. Both of them? Yeah. Cool. Stupid. A person below normal intelligence. Hey, you want to hear the most annoying sound in the world? Guys! Yeah, guys! Guys! If they each had half a brain, they'd still only have half a brain. Oh, look, Frost. Hold on. Jim Carrey. Jeff Daniels. Oh, geez, look at the butt on that. Yeah. He must work out. Dumb and dumber. <laughs> For these guys, every day is a no-brainer. <laughs> <laughs>